Hey, everybody. It's Tuesday. That means Louisville football coach Scott Satterfield met with the media to talk about Friday's upcoming game against Florida State. Spoke for about 20 minutes, but you don't need a full 20 minutes. I'm here to really quickly, just in a few minutes, share with you the key points of what Coach Satterfield had to say about his team. And the first topic that he took on was the fact that though it won, and it was a big win for the program down at Central Florida last Friday, Louisville needs to play much cleaner. And we got, we got to get a lot better at, at just playing more disciplined football. And I think that's the penalties. I think, um, you know, we, we've not been good in the red zone offensively. Well, we, you know, we've, I think we've had maybe three or four red zone penalties that have knocked us out of that. Uh, you know, you get long yards in the red zone, it's hard to overcome. Um, I think defensively last week, you, you, two times we jump off sides, one on fourth down, it gives them a first down. The other one on third down, they end up throwing an interception and we're all sides. Um, you know, we, we just got to we got to play a lot cleaner football. I think, you know, anytime you're going to get these close games and you, know, you don't want to beat yourself. And I think, um, you know, very easily could have happened last game and certainly happened the first game. We did we, you know, turn the ball over and, and penalties. So we got to we got to we got to play cleaner football. That's just focus and um, every day of practice and continuing to focus throughout the game and, and not have those things happen. Well, the second thing that Satterfield talked about uh, there's a question I asked him just that they were coming back off of a big victory. How did the team react? What was the mood of the team? Was there a lot more confidence when they came back to practice after the win at Central Florida? I thought the yesterday defensively, they had a really good day. Uh, you know, still high intensity flying around. We were in full pass <laughs> yesterday. Uh, you know, I, I think the energy level uh, way better in, in this last contest, which we got to continue to bring. And I think that's what we want in practice. And then we did that yesterday. Uh, particularly on the defensive side, the offensive side wasn't quite it wasn't as good as the defensive side yesterday. But um, you know, but again, just having that energy flying around. Um, I think the sideline was way better in, this, in the second game compared to the first. Um, more, more focus, um, guys pulling for each other, all those type of things. We got to continue this week. And finally, Scott Satterfield talked about Malik Cunningham. He was asked about Cunningham's performance. Cunningham started the game at Central Florida really sharp, completed his first seven passes. He wasn't always as sharp going forward, although he did get into the game more with his legs. He ran the ball effectively, as he usually does. Satterfield talks about what Louisville needs from Malik Cunningham going forward. Well, I mean, we, he's got to throw the ball better. There's no question. We, you know, we, we had some plays the other night we could have hit and extended some drives. Um, you know, he, he was excellent in the run game. Did a great job with that. It's a big play. I mean, you know, the, the long touchdown run really, you know, got us into the game there. Kind of, kind of broke us open, broke the game open. But uh, we got to, we do have to throw the ball better. There's no question about that. I mean, I think um, utilizing our receivers more, uh, Wiggins more, getting Wiggins more involved, uh, Amari more involved. Uh, you know, T. Huddy's getting some opportunities, some, some touches, um, but, you know, getting some other guys involved. Forward, you know, we tried to get Ford involved last week. Central Florida, I think we did um, a few times, but um, but really, you know, trying to spread that that ball out, Braden Smith as well, um, you know. So there is opportunities out there. We got to take advantage of them, and you know, can, you know, Malik's got to continue to work and get it, and you know, hopefully it'll happen this week. We'll be able to open it up and get the pass game going. Satterfield, obviously optimistic going into the Florida State game, hopes to see a big Louisville crowd there for the team's home opener. You can see more about his Tuesday press conference from Rick Bozich. He's got a column up at WDRB.com. Thanks for watching.